Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. This is Jacob Salanix with Spitzer Chevrolet out in Amherst, Ohio. And today I'm gonna to be going over the 2022 Chevy Equinox. For those who don't know, they did have a refresh for the 2022 model year. This is the LT trim level behind me. I'm gonna go over what features and options come on the LT trim. Be sure to like this video, comment below your thoughts on the refreshed Equinox, and subscribe to the channel for future videos. Alrighty guys, so as I mentioned, this is your 2022 Chevy Equinox refreshed for this model year. I'm gonna go over what has changed on the Equinox um, and also go over what the LT trim level has to offer you. So just looking here, you're gonna notice more of a, a sleek, sporty, I guess you can say aggressive look to it. Um, they're going more towards like the blazer look with the headlights as well as the daytime running lights. You also have a different style grill here and this one has the black bow tie package on it. Like I said, it's more sporty. Um, that's what this market's really grabbing. You're gonna notice the 18 inch wheels here on the side. The wheels are available in the 17, 18 or 19 inch tire based off of the trim level uh, or options that you get on the car. As mentioned, this is the LT trim level, still available in LS, LT, new for the 22 model year is an RS, and then your premier trim levels. RS is probably one of my favorites. I love the new trim level. We just don't get enough of these things in. So new front fascia looks very good. Uh, still comes equipped with the 1.5 liter four cylinder turbo engine, which produces about 170 horsepower uh, with that turbo charged four cylinder in it which still maximizes really, really good fuel economy close to the mid 20, 30 range. You can see you have your turn signal indicator here on the side with the LT trim. And this is the mosaic black colorway. So you can see it's a metallic paint, looks very good. Speaking of colors, they did come out with four new colors for this model year. Um, very, very sharp colors. You got a sea glass blue, um many many other colors so this one coming to the back here you can see your lt in the corner and then this is the main difference with the rear fascia they basically flipped over the red tail light and the reverse light so the white would be on top the red would be on the bottom on the 2021 model year and then this chrome piece at the bottom uh, basically stops there in the middle. It used to expand all the way around and then it's a little different look to it as well Like I said, this one does have that black bow tie package on it as well Really good option if you're looking for a sporty look to it Does come equipped with the power lift gate So this folds up you can see the all-weather liners here Covers the back seat as well as well as your trunk area I'm going to go ahead and show you a little additional storage with it. So you can fold this up, have another storage space. And then underneath here, you have your spare tire. So very nice. Extra storage. You can keep things in there. And then over here on the side, you can pull these tabs. And this will lower your back seats for you. So you don't have to go around and do it. Very nice. It's very easy and um, can be very useful if you're trying to load something into the car. You can see up here, this is how you lower your tailgate. You can also open and close the tailgate from your key fob as well as inside the vehicle and I'll show you that. This one is equipped with the sunroof, which I'll show you inside, but it comes with these black roof rails on it. And then you can see your sunroof there in the center. Now we're gonna go ahead and open up your back door here. So you're gonna see the overall space that you have. Most people that get an Equinox have family, kids, friends. Um, it's gonna be a family friendly vehicle. You can go ahead, step in here. As you can see, plenty of room. You got those awesome floor liners that go all the way through. And then your passengers have the air vents as well as the two USB ports. And then there is a 120 volt down there at the bottom. So very nice, very spacious. You have that absolutely massive sunroof to look at as well. Good view of your front cabin. But it's very, uh, very comfortable, smooth ride. And as you can see, 
The seats in this one are cloth. Leather is available, but they're sporty, they're sleek, they're nice. And then you also have the fold down right here with cup holders for your passenger's convenience. One more view, zoomed out here. Alrighty guys, so now on the inside cabin, we're gonna go over a couple different options in here as well as packages that this car in particular has. First, I'm gonna start off with the blind spot monitor. That's a convenience package feature. Um, this one, convenience package is very popular on the LT trim. Gets you a lot of, a lot of features for uh, a good price, in my opinion. You have your power lift gate here, so you can go ahead and push that button, opens and closes it. Your power mirrors and windows over here. We're gonna go ahead and hop in. It is a powered seat. Powered seat with support. So here is your cabin here. So with your convenience package, you get several things here. Um, first, you're gonna get dual zone climate for your driver and passenger, as well as heated powered seats. Super nice to have. Uh, it has front and rear park assist. So if you go ahead and put the vehicle in reverse, it will actually beep at you when um, you're pulling close to something, forward or backwards. Also, another package that this one has is the advanced safety package, which gets you the HD surround. So this is basically a bird's eye view of your car, shows you all around the vehicle. It's a super nice system to have. With that package, you also get heated power mirrors, and you're also gonna get adaptive cruise control with that safety package. So the vehicle will automatically um, begin to brake or increase its speed based off of the person that's in front of you on a highway or whatever. That's using your front collision alert right here. And then that your, is your cruise control options. So that is a super nice feature. Convenience package, you also get the power lift gate um, and this leather wrap steering wheel. The other package this one has is the infotainment package. So one, you're gonna get a heated steering wheel, which is super nice to have. It has extra data ports all around, so USB ports. That 120 volt that you saw in the back seat is also with that infotainment package. Comes with the bigger eight inch touchscreen. Um, nice layout, super easy to use with navigation. Um, and Apple CarPlay is available uh, wireless in this one as well. So super nice with the infotainment. We're gonna go ahead and start on the steering wheel here. So like I said, you have cruise control, you have your heated steering wheel, your lane keep assist, which is on that convenience package. And then this controls your um, speeds, your trips, your fuel economy, oil life, all that fun stuff there. You can see that little indicator on the side. Since this has navigation, it'll actually show you the speed of the road that you're on. So super cool. You have automatic high beams here, your turn signals, windshield wipers, and then your headlights are down here with your dimmer. Of course, push to start right here by pushing your foot on the brake and pushing that button. This is your key fob on the 22 Equinox. You have your lock, unlock, remote start by hitting lock first and then holding this down for about three seconds. Once again, another way to open and close your tailgate and then a panic button right there. Now we're gonna go to the massive eight inch touchscreen. You have audio, which includes AM, FM, and Sirius radio all listed on the side. You can save your channels by holding it down up top there. Go ahead and hit the little house. Now you have your phone, which is your Bluetooth settings. Navigation, which you can pull this up and basically shows where you are. You can do voice commands for looking for your location, points of interest, super easy to use. Wi-Fi hotspots built in. You can have different users. And then you have that Apple CarPlay and Android Auto available. You can hit the home here. You can skip your channels here. And then your volume is just moving this up and down. You can see one new thing for the 2022 model year is they got rid of the auto stop start not being able to turn it off. There is an override now. So if you hit this here, you're gonna see auto stop off. That light is off. That means it will no longer turn off at lights. And then you have your hazards right there next to it. This is your climate control. So as I mentioned, convenience, confidence, you get the dual zone climate as well as the heated driver and passenger seats. You have front and rear defrosters, fan speed here, where you want your air position and then AC, and then you can sync both sides up with each other. Another for 2022 is a different style shifter, a little more sporty. You have the Chevy logo there, super nice, super convenient, feels good. Your park assist button is right here so you can turn it on or off. 
and then down there you have a USB, a USB-C, auxiliary, and then your 12 volt. I'm trying to get this to focus a little bit for you guys. Electronic parking brake down there at the bottom. Super nice, easy to use cabin here. It's OnStar equipped up the top there. And now we're gonna go over your sunroof. So full panoramic with the sunshade super big um, we're gonna go ahead and shut the sunshade using this left hand side you can see it's completely powered and moves up just like that and we're gonna go ahead and move it back and then you have your sunroof which you have the tilt option as well as the full slide so you can keep sliding it back you just got to hold it you have your net that comes up and now it's super bright in here so we're gonna go ahead and shut that Sorry for the poor quality if it's not coming in too well. You have a sunglass holder up here. So this is your cabin, like I said. It's a refresh, so not everything's new. A lot of things look the same. Very nice that they got the override in. They got some new packages. The heated steering wheel um, is a really good um, option. And then when you see the price point, you'll see uh, why I say that. So I'm gonna go ahead and out show you guys the window sticker real quick hop out here you can see 22 equinox lt front wheel drive it's not an all wheel uh, the color the engine six speed automatic all of your standard features your warranties and then you see confidence convenience package best bang for the buck you get so many features down here lists all of the options and features sunroof 1605 option that infotainment package is an $895 option, and then your safety package over there. So your MSRP comes out to $33,910 on this car. Super, super nice. It's a good uh, bang for your buck. Lots of safety features, a lot of equipment, and it's a good looking car too. I do really like the new uh, 22 Equinoxes. The refresh was great. People are really loving the LT RSs and the Premiers very happy with them and still a really good price point on the LS. So I hope you guys liked this video, found the information you're looking for. Be sure to like the video, comment below your thoughts on the Equinox, and be sure to subscribe to the channel for future videos. Thank you and we'll see you for the next one.